With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students, so the question is a square loop of side L is kept in a uniform magnetic field B such that its plane make an angle of alpha with a magnetic field B weight. Okay. Now, the loop carries a current of I. The torque experienced by the loop in this position is. So, for this, let's look at the solution. So, let us assume uh, we have a magnetic field like this. Okay. Into this direction, which I have shown by the arrow. Right. Into this magnetic field, we have just kept a current carrying square loop like this in such a way that it is make an angle of alpha with respect to magnetic field B. Okay. Now this loop is carrying a current of I. Okay. While the side of square is going to us that is L okay so here according to question we have to find the torque experienced by the loop because of this magnetic field B okay now first of all to find the torque experienced by this current carrying loop we need to find the magnetic moment so to find the torque experienced by this current carrying loop First of all, we need to find the magnetic moment for this square loop, right? Because we know that the torque is given by T bar is equals to magnetic moment M bar cross magnetic field B bar. Okay, now let's suppose to find uh, this magnetic moment, this square is having the area of capital A. Okay, so by the means of formula here I can say that the magnetic moment for this square loop would become equals to N I A bar where N is representing the number of loop, I is the current and A is the area. Now according to question uh, here we have only one square loop that's why this will become 1 into current flowing through the loop is I into area of the square will be L square that means the magnetic moment for the square loop would become is equals to I into L square right and the direction for this magnetic moment will be along the direction of area vector okay now the direction for the area vector will be perpendicular to the square loop like this okay so the same direction will be for this magnetic moment too okay now if you see here so this is square loop making an angle of alpha with respect to this magnetic field b while this magnetic moment making an angle of 90 degree with this loop so that we can say that here uh, this much angle will become 90 minus alpha okay so the required torque experienced by the current carrying loop would become equals to magnetic moment that is i l square into magnetic field that is b sine of theta now here according to question the angle theta is 90 minus alpha. so if you substitute the value of theta so this will become b i l square into sine of 90 minus of alpha now we know that sine 90 minus theta is equal to cos theta right so this would become cos of alpha so finally the required torque experienced by the loop because of magnetic field will become B i l square cos of alpha right so if we look at the given option so option third will become correct answer for this question so this is the required solution i hope you like the solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today